10 Strange Things The King of Thailand Spends His Billions On King Maha Vajiralongkorn, officially known as King Rama X, is the richest monarch in the world, with a personal net worth of 43 billion dollars. The king is known for doing some pretty eccentric things, like wandering around shopping malls with a crop top and flying his own private planes. He also took control of the assets of the Thai royal family, freeing up 30 to 60 billion dollars to use it as he sees fit. Here are some of the strange and extravagant things the king spends his billions on, from a secret lakefront villa in Germany to a lavish funeral for his beloved dog. 4 Boeing 737 For most monarchs, one or perhaps two private jets would be sufficient, but not for the king of Thailand. The king has four Boeing 737s in his collection, each worth about $90 million. Each jet is estimated to have an annual operating cost of $3 million, including the cost of maintenance and fuel. The king has a special taste for aircraft. He knows how to fly and he often flies his jets himself when he's traveling over the seas or just for a quick trip through Thailand. After one of his planes was stopped in Munich, Germany in 2011 by officials trying to collect a 20-year debt from the government of Thailand to a German construction company, the king spent even more money on his planes. He paid about 12 million euros or 14.5 million dollars to have it returned and Thailand and Germany tied. Vintage Rolls Royce The Thai king has some luxury vehicles in his impressive collection of cars, such as a 700,000 Maybach 62, a 190,000 Mercedes S-Class, a 100,000 Mercedes V-Class, and a $47,000 Cadillac DTS. But his absolute favorite car is his three vintage Rolls Royce. He's often seen being driven by Thailand in his $2.2 million Rolls Royce Silver Spurs limousine. He also has a rare Rolls Royce Phantom V 1960 worth $1.1 million. And it is rumored that he owns a $1 million 1964 Rolls Royce Silver Cloud 3. With all the cars in this world within their price range, it seems that the king has a preference for old-fashioned luxury. Quarantine holidays in the Bavarian Ops While the quarantine kept many rulers trapped in their palaces, the Thai king decided it was time to flee Thailand for a short vacation. He is reportedly staying at the four-star Grand Hotel Solnig Beach in the Bavarian Ops with his entourage of 20 Woman. Although most hotels in Germany are currently closed, this hotel has been given special permission to remain open only to the king and his guests. The hotel, which opened in 1890, is known for skiing, open scenery, and hiking trails. But the king has spent most of his time in the suites of King Ludwig II, named after a former Bavarian king. The entire fourth floor of the hotel is reserved only for the king and his guests, and it is estimated that the king can pay up to $1 million a month to stay there. In addition to a terrace overlooking Germany's highest peaks, the hotel's facilities include a swimming pool, gym, spa, and bar. A funeral for his dog. The Thai king's best friend was a little poodle toy named Fufu, who used it to dress in formal attire and be taken to important state dinners. 
where he apparently drank from the guests' glasses. The king even declared the dog to be a chief martial hare and probably spent a small fortune on all of his small clothes. Unfortunately, the poodle pet passed away in 2015, but the king spared no expense on his funeral. Fufu was cremated after four days of traditional Buddhist funeral rituals and received a lavish farewell that was rumored to cost up to two million dollars. His coronation of 31 million dollars. Since the king made government money his money, declaring that real assets are at his discretion, his coronation of 31 million dollars technically came out of his own pocket. When the king was crowned, 1,300 people and a few elephants parodied near the Grand Palace of Thailand for six and a half hours of lavish festivities and celebrations. During the ceremony, the Thai king was presented with many sacred objects, such as the royal nine-layer umbrella made of white silk with gold accents. He also received the victory sword made of gold and inlaid with diamonds. And, of course, his new royal possessions also included the 7.3 kilo golden crown of victory. After becoming king, he also inherited the Jubilee Diamond, made of 545.67 carats of gold and estimated at $12 million. Four royal weddings. King Maha Bajla Longkorn may have had only one royal wedding after ascending the throne, but it was definitely not his first royal wedding. The king had four luxurious marriages. His first was in 1977, and it lasted 16 years before the couple divorced. The prince then decided to marry a Thai actress, but his marriage lasted only two years. Vajra Longkorn married his third wife in 2001, but in 2014, she was stripped of her royal title because it was believed that she and her relatives had abused her connections with the crown. But it was an expensive divorce. She received six million dollars and was later sent into exile. The king's fourth and current wedding took place in 2019, days before his coronation. Queen Sutta served as a special unit of the queen's guard before they were married and dressed for the ceremony was made of Thai silk and cost about three thousand dollars. The king concluded the ceremony with a lavish party to celebrate her reign. A secret villa in Germany. The king is sick of the Grand Palace, so he needs a royal home away from home. He owns a secret lakefront villa in Munich, Germany, which he bought for 12 million euros, or 14.5 million dollars. The luxurious property is known as Villa Stolber. It is impossible to see inside the residence because the king maintains his strong security and the villa has been so well hidden tall hedges and major trees keep the owner away from prying eyes but the house has direct access to the lake with a private dock, a living area of 1,400 square meters and at least 15 rooms. In a 1994 advertisement before the sale of the house, it was said that the place had many fireplaces and a library for the environment. No one is sure why the king loves spending so much time in Germany, but it's definitely one of his favorite places outside of Thailand. Nine billion dollars in stock. The king's fortune may be vast, but since he was crowned, he has been involving the monarchy in the stock market. In 2018, the Crown Property Department announced that assets previously held by the Crown Property would be transferred to the king. The organization had already controlled the royal fortune on behalf of the monarchy. Now that the money is under the control of the king, with the assets previously held and the new assets that the king has purchased, it is estimated that he now has a 23% stake in CM Commercial Bank. 
he also has a 33.3% stake in Cement Group of CM, the country's largest industrial conglomerate. His shares total $9 billion, signaling that the king is trying to increase his fortune in assets outside of his traditional royal duties. Crop Tops and Fake Tattoos we are sure that crop tops and fake tattoos did not cost much of the king's money, but we can talk about the strange things that the king buys without mentioning his fashion options. King Maha Vajiralongkorn was seen in shopping malls and descending from planes in Germany, wearing very tight tops and sometimes with fake tattoos on his arms and back. While in a shopping mall in Germany, he was seen eating ice cream while shopping and would also have spent at least $500,000 while there, buying gifts for his many girlfriends. The king is estimated to spend up to a million dollars a month on gifts for his female in Torridge. Apparently, it is good to be with the king. White Elephants Let's talk about elephants, which the law states that all white elephants are the property of the king because they're considered a symbol of royalty and treated like deities in Thai culture. Not long after King Maha Vajralongkorn was crowned, he received his first white elephant. An elephant known as Ply Ekachai was the first to be found and presented to the king. He is housed in the conservation center with a huge portrait of the king occupying a wall so that the elephant will never forget him. Even if the king did not have to spend any money to acquire this elephant, at least $1 million will come out of government funds to house, feed and care for the animal. He will also receive a new title and will be treated like royalty. The king's father received 10 white elephants during his 70-year reign, and King Maha Vajiralongkorn is likely to receive more as well. The government takes good care of all white elephants, found without sparing expenses for the rest of their long lives. It's time to end things. King Maha Vajralongkorn is the richest king in the world. But do you know how much he's ahead of other monarchs? His $43 billion wealth puts him well above the second richest, the Sultan of Brunei, who has $28 billion. What did you think of this video? We want to hear from you, so hurry up to the comments! Please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel for more fun videos daily! Thanks for watching and see you next time! Bye bye!